On February 24, 1986, John Ruetten returned home to his condo in Van Nuys, California, to find Sherry, his wife of only three months, dead in the living room. Two years before, John and Rasmus and Sherry met at a party in the spring of 84. John was immediately attracted to Sherry. As soon as he met her, he got her number from a mutual friend. They went on a date and instantly hit it off. John moved into Sherry's condo on Balboa Boulevard, and they married on the 23rd of November 1985. Friends and family described them as utterly in love. But tragedy was waiting. On February 24, 1986, her battered and bloody body was found on the floor of her living room. In addition to being beaten and shot three times in the chest, Rasmussen had suffered a bite to her arm during the vicious struggle. The detectives on the scene decided Rasmussen had been the victim of a botched burglary as her home was ransacked and her BMW was missing. It was a theory of the crime the department would stand behind for decades. But Sherry's family wasn't as convinced. Her father, Nels Rasmussen, told police his son-in-law's ex had approached his daughter while she was working and told her, If I can't have John, no one else will. But Nell's theory was cast aside, according to his attorney, who would years later tell reporters, he was always diverted. He was told repeatedly that he'd been watching too much TV. At the time, LAPD detectives insisted that it was a burglary gone wrong. But the truth was actually more sinister. In more than one instance, evidence connected to Sherry's case appeared to have grown legs, including some that vanished at a time when it was apparently needed the most that 27 years later, the real story was figured out. Former Los Angeles police detective Stephanie Lazarus was found guilty in 2012 of murdering Rasmussen after department matched her saliva DNA to a bite mark on the Sherry's arm. The John and Lazarus met in college and became friends who occasionally had sex. Though it appeared Lazarus was more serious about Ruetten than he was about her, they remained close for years. But after some time, Lazarus learned John was to be married to Sherry. She decided to get revenge after their marriage. She was convicted of first-degree murder and sentenced to 27 years to life in prison.